Hey guys, and welcome back to a brand new episode of Folktale. This is a early access game on Steam, guys. It's brought to you by Game Foundry, and it's uh, selling right now for $18.74, but normally it goes for $24.99. Again, depending on when you watch the video and uh, how long the game's been out, that may be a little bit higher, a little bit lower, depending on, uh, you know, of course, different circumstances. Now, the game is a really, really cool kind of uh, city builders mixed in with a little bit of warfare. As you can see, I already have some walls set up there with some trebuchets on there. Of course, over here on this wall, you can put some of these uh, little uh, arrow towers and things of that sort on there. Now, these are the regular tier one walls right here. And then you have the tier three walls over here, which look really cool, but they take a little bit longer to build. And I think they're just a little bit stronger overall. So definitely something to consider when thinking about which ones to build. Now, I tried building arrow towers on top of here, and they just, uh, it wouldn't work. So I don't know if it was just in the wrong place or what, but I'm pretty sure the trebuchets are a little stronger. Unfortunately, I don't think they will shoot closer by. So if you have something like this right here where these guys keep spawning, I don't think uh, the trebuchets will help in that regard. But we're going to build them over here in a minute uh, after we finish off the wall surrounding our, our uh, whole place so that we can, uh, you know, check it out. But first, like I said, we're going to finish off building the walls so that we're completely and totally uh, secure. So let's go down as much as possible. Let's see. Can we go this way? Yeah. Because I want to get as much room as we possibly can. Let's see. Trebuchet or crossbow. There we go. So it does allow you to put the crossbow down. And you can put a lot more of them, too. Look at that. Three of them. Yeah, nice. I like that. Okay, let's do one more right here. What's in the way? Why can't we connect that? Hmm. It won't let us do it. Is it because we're short on money? Resources? No, nope, it just won't let us connect that. So what we end up uh, having to do is uh, do it over here? No, it won't let us do that either. Hmm. I wonder why. What's getting in the way? These rocks? Really? We might actually have to send some people over here to get rid of some of these rocks then so that we can uh, finish up this wall right here. But uh, while we have the extra cash, I'm going to go ahead and uh, sell that wall. And uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, sell that as well. And let's go ahead and build this back over here. Right there. And then we'll go ahead and uh, build another one going this direction not quite enough cash to do it just yet so let's put that there of course now these spiders can get inside so we're gonna have to worry about that but uh, like i said that's it's not too big of a deal at the moment let's see can we put some more down yes we can uh let's put it going that way yeah that's where we want it and this one we're gonna put the uh, the trebuchet in just because i want to see what it might be able to hit over here on the side and i think it's going to be able to fire over here into this guy's base so we're going to have to worry about that uh yeah might be causing some issues here in a minute because they can't get in over here so let's bring our guys where are my main guys here they are my lord let's bring them back over here an honor. so they can protect as much as possible Ooh, check it out we got some polished sapphire uncommon polished uh, amethyst and pol polished obsidian these are all rare. Haven't seen too many of those. And then, of course, a lot of gold. So definitely worth looking at. And he is firing. He is firing, but we can't see what he's doing because we don't have access to this area yet. Of course, if we come over here, we're going to find that, uh, you know, there's a lot of enemies. So I'm going to let him continue to do what he's doing for a little bit. And then we'll send our guys in. <laughs> move along. Actually move him up a little bit higher. There is an enemy, or at least there was know. an enemy, right there, sitting right here. Oh, there we go. You dare interrupt Brolos while he convenes with the spirits of the ancient brothers? Awaken from your trance and cast down these plane walkers. Okay, so we'll we'll bring them back a little closer to uh, our castles so they can do some damage to him. Yeah, you can see he's uh, bringing some of his little friends with him. Let's go ahead and uh, get that in there. Come to daddy. <laughs> Let's do our uh, our stun, our shield bash. So now he's stunned. A couple of them are stunned. We're doing some damage here. We'll have him attack the main guy here and uh, do taunt to make sure he's on my main one. We'll kill off the little dude. There we go. We did it, guys. Pretty easy when you have uh, those towers there with you. Let's go ahead and loot that. Ooh, we got some stuff here. 
Uh, Ruby Ring, Uncommon, all doesn't do anything though. And then of course the uh, Chainmail Coif, a close fitting Chainmail cap that covers the top, back, and sides of the head. Usable by the City Watch, Sir Gregory, and uh, four physical armor plus one mine. So we're going to go ahead and loot all that. Plus this guy did level. And I want to put a couple points into his uh, his mind because that's going to allow him to cast more of his little spells there, which we definitely need. So let's go ahead and put that on him. I guess we could put the ring on there too, but and this is not really too big of a point in that just yet. So let's send these guys down here, all of them. Mine is to obey. Bring them back. There you go. You can see he's getting attacked. Let's go ahead and just go in there. I don't think they're going to be able to stand against us. And while we're doing that, our resources are building back up. So... You know, again, not too big of a deal to kind of take some time out, not put any more buildings down, and just kind of search the map for any resources that may be over here. Let's come over here. You can see there's a lot of people in here, so we're going to run in, get some aggro if we can. If they see us, there we go. They saw us. Let's back it up. <laughs> Somebody is over here getting wrecked by that trebuchet. Yeah, that was him. Okay, let's do our shield bash. We'll do the taunt as well. Uh, and now we got some more guys coming in. Let's back it up. We don't want to fight all of them. Today you die. Can we not get it up further? There we go. Come on, come on, come on. Good old, come on. Go a little farther back. A little farther. There we go. Okay, so we're inside of our base now, and I think we're we're good to go. We should be able to take these guys on fairly well. Let's go ahead and get a little bit extra defense just in case. And of course, we could use the uh, decisive victory, but I'm going to use it on the next guy. Here we go. Oh, I didn't kill him because I didn't have him targeted, apparently. Okay, so note to self. Be very, very cautious. Oh, we lost one of our, war our warriors. Dang it. Okay. Those guys are not easy to replace. We'll have to build the barracks before we can. Let's come over here and loot this stuff. A little bit more gold. And how are you guys doing over here? What's that noise? Oh, is it this thing? Oh, because it's still working. And it's almost like it's stuck. Because that noise usually isn't there 24-7. Let's come in here and take this guy out. In fact, we have another level, so let's give him a little bit more mind. Four is probably enough. Let's do a taunt. Let's back this up. Let's back it up. Come on, guys. Run it. Run it. Get out of there. Let's bring him over here. And if that noise continues, I may have to save it and then come back in. It may uh, get rid of it for us because that's not supposed to be on constantly. Some? <laughs> this guy does, Funk. You're going to die. You're going to die a horrible death. Let's do some a little extra armor. Let's see if we can get this guy out of there. Come on. Run it. Run it. Run, run, run. Run around. Run around. I'm going to get this guy to come over here and taunt him. There we go. We saved him. Just barely. Okay. You're doing good. And the noise stops. Nope, there it is again. Okay, so let's loot. Loot that as well. There you go. Okay, so let's give these guys a chance to uh, take a break. And I'm going to put down the remaining wall right here. Connect the two pieces. Can I zoom out a little bit more? Yes, I can. Okay. And over here, we're going to do the exact same thing. Although, I think I'm going to put the uh, trebuchet bucket. Because I just like the range on that. That's really, really nice to kind of offset the uh, damage so like every other one seems like a good combination there and of course now we can see the entire base over here so if anybody else spawns we'll be able to kill them and then loot that stuff settlers. uh did we oh because we lost one yeah one of them died right off the bat okay so where did he where did we lose him from that one gets still has one that still has one that has four that has three and this is three so we lost him over here so let's go My ahead pleasure. and Tell him to come back over here and mine stone. That's one of the main things we're waiting for right now. Stone is used in these walls right here. And, uh, yeah, we, we definitely want walls around our base. What else can we upgrade? Uh, we could do stone. Let's let's look at what these guys are doing. Actually, I'm going to leave that there because I'm probably going to destroy this hut. And I don't know if doing research on one hut applies to the next one. So I don't want to waste too much gold on that one. This, however, I can do research on crop rotation. Let's do that. And we can do grease as well, as soon as that one is done. Shouldn't take too long on that. What else do we have that we can do? This one, I think, is fully upgraded. Nope, this one can still go up one more, so let's do bait. Because we got the goal for it. Yep, and that's good. What about farms? Uh, no, we can't do anything to that other than sell it or, cha or change what it is. Let's go into... Ooh, wow, okay, so we're... 
We're a little low on something. What are we low on? Is it food? Variety. Oh, you know what? They've ran out of berries. Yeah, they've ran out of berries. Okay, so we want to keep it like that for now. Because we've been giving them a lot of food lately. They still have tons and tons of steak. And I haven't built the flour. Or I've, I've gotten the flour. You can see just how much I have of it. 215. I just haven't built the bakery yet. So that's because I've been waiting on the walls. I didn't want to progress too quickly without that being done. Because I want to stay at that nice 138 on the, uh, the, the culture rating before we go up a little higher. And, and risk getting uh, destroyed by enemies who come in. Let's see, can we build on these things now? No, still can't do it. It's those rocks. Those rocks are in the way, guys. We need, to, we need to get rid of those, but I need workers to be able to do that. Oh, there we go. Let's do it right here. Ah, there's more rocks. Dang, man. They are everywhere over here. How about right there? And that's going to go across the bridge, but I can always build a, uh, you know, a opening here so they can get across if they need to. And that's definitely something we're going to do here in the future. Okay, so they are protected from over here because they can't get around at all right there. Let's do a trebuchet to give it the uh, the most range as possible in that direction. Yeah, I like that. And then they're still kind of vulnerable over here. They can still get in through the little gap. So we may just build a wall over here from like right here to right here and just kind of block it off because it doesn't need to be completely surrounded. And then, of course, they can still get in over here as well. But... Again, that's not too big of a deal. Ooh, Sir Gregory, 17 physical damage. It's a sword and a warhammer, which is a, for stonecutters, 20 physical damage, as well as a bronze key. I don't know what the bronze key is for, but we're definitely going to give Sir Gregory Ready to serve. his new weapon. So let's go into his inventory right there and give him something new to use. Now, he's using a sword that's 16 physical damage. This one's 17, so it's just slightly better than what he's using before. Which, you know, is okay. I'll definitely take it. Uh, why did all my inventory get jumbled up in here? That is, uh, that's kind of weird. Can I not scroll down? Okay, let's go ahead and put all the ones that I need to keep an eye on for down here on the bottom. Flour is not one of them. Not yet anyways. Uh, food. Food I need to keep an eye on. And beer. Mead I need to keep an eye on. So we'll put flour right here. These are ones that I use, but I don't really need to keep an eye on too much. There we go. Those are stuff right there. And we'll get rid of this. Hmm. We're going to fill up our inventory pretty quickly here. We did get something for the stone cutters, right? Where was it? Yeah, stone cutters, 20 physical damage. So let's go over to one of the stone cutters and give that to them. If they don't die, you know, they're going uh, to pretty be pretty well off with it. So let's give it to this guy. He's level 3 already. Put that in there. So 20 physical damage compared to what he already had. Not bad. I'll definitely take it. Let's see. What, what did he already have anyways? This guy's level 1. And he has a 10 physical damage. So I don't think that helps them mine stone. But I think it does help them in an attack. Okay. These walls have not been built yet, have they? No. Because this is how high the walls are supposed to be when they're finally done. So we just don't have anybody to come over here and build on them. So let's go ahead and upgrade Let's do a, another cottage. We'll do one more cottage here. Actually, go back to that, and we'll put that down right here. As close as possible. Right there. There we go. Okay, so we should get another five people out of that, which is going to raise up our culture. But we're going to get more people out of it in the end. That's what we need. And I just need them to start building some of these walls up so they look a little bit better. And uh, we have the ability to build a gatehouse. No, it's too short. How about a gatehouse over here? Hmm. We're going to need to make these a little bit longer then. Because we definitely do want a gatehouse over here somewhere. Come on. A gatehouse here? No, it won't let us build a gatehouse over there either. Dang it. Uh, how about here? We can destroy the wall and build another. Yeah, let's go ahead and destroy that. Because I need more space and I need a gatehouse. Let's do tier two. Can't go out in that direction. Because that rock. And that's too short. So no, I need to I need to destroy this rock. So I need some of my guys to come over here. Let's see, have we gotten any new people yet? No, they haven't built the house. Do I have any workers? 
I don't know if I have any workers. I think they might all be uh, set to uh, do something because one of them did die, and that could have been the guy that I had set to uh, to build stuff. So let's see. We're going to need to take one of these woodworkers and have them fix this cottage for me if he'll do it. I may have to de uh, demote him for first. And he's level 4, so I really don't want to do that. What about you? What level are you? You're gathering resources. I don't want to demote you either. What now? Percy. I guess you're going to get demoted, man. Let's see. How do I demote you? Toggle AI off. Guard mode. Hmm. I know I can do it from in here. So I guess let's do it from in here. We'll find somebody. One of these people. Okay, we'll demote you. And now we should have one person walking around able to uh, build some stuff. Where are you at? She should have a orange uniform on. Now, I do wish that they had a button in here that allows you to find, like, idle workers, people who aren't assigned to anything. But because it's so easy to assign people now when you just click on a building and tell them to do it, you don't really need that option in there. But for certain situations, it would still be kind of cool to have that. I know a lot of games like this do have that built in there with it. Uh, are you building? Where's that noise coming from? Are you coming over here and building this? Hmm. I should have clicked on her to find her first. Oh, there we go. We got some more reinforcements over here of this thing attacking. So it's attacking the spider. Oh, yeah. It's going to kill her. Let's take... Oh, we got some pants. Two physical damage for armor and one agility made for pretty much any class whatsoever, including... The City Watch, Tailoring, Merchants, and Sir Gregory. I think Sir Gregory already has better pants than that, right? Standing firm. What happens to his little friend? Is his friend there? Tally oh, yeah, his friend's still there. Busy, busy, busy. Okay, so Ready let's click on battle. him and look in there. Yeah, he already has good pants on, so I'm going to leave those pants on him. Let's give yeah, let's give the pants to somebody over here that's not going to die. Down. Okay, yeah, I'll give it to you. Let's go into our inventory, just to get it out of the inventory. And have it on somebody. 10% extra damage right there. That's nice. Or extra uh, defense, I should say. Or not defense. Uh, his, his accuracy looked like it went up. <laughs> Are you guys not building? I demoted one of you. Where did you go? What are you doing if you're... Yes, my dear. Okay, I think we have enough on this one. So let's demote this guy as well. Can we not do it? There we go. Demote. Okay. Peasant, peasant. So we have three peasants, but where are they all at? Okay, so she's running over. What is she doing? Okay, so she's going to build that first. Okay, so I have other peasants doing the same thing, but I don't know where at. Why they're taking so long. Because it says I had three peasants available. Is this thing being built yet? No. Okay, so we're going to let them do it on their own schedule. Again, it's going to allow me to get some more stone. And you can see it's being uh, being built. I do want them to come over here, though. I really, really want them to chop that down. But I think I need to leave that open for the moment. Oh, yes. Look at that, guys. Killing some more of these and killing those spiders. Those spiders are just nonstop crazy. And that's what wrecked my town many, many, many times before. So let's see. We got five more people. You know what? No, I'm going to tell you to come over to the cottage. That's going to give me five more people out of that, and right now I need that more than I need, uh, you know, the walls being built up. Let's see. You guys are still good. May have to lower the food down here pretty soon. Not because I'm running out of the steak, but because they're going to want a lot more when those people come in. And I don't know if they're going to be able to keep up with it and keep them as happy. Okay, so that's almost done. That's going to be good. And I can't upgrade these. Until, uh, you know, we get to 200 and we're close to that. So once we get to 200, all these things are going to be raised up to the max. Granted, I have enough stone to do so. Or not enough stone. Yeah, well, stone too, but as well as uh, gold. But stone seems to be a steady supply coming in. And that's fully maxed out, I think, as well. So let me look in here. Can I do anything more to it? Nah, just to expand the, the territory. That's not worth it. What about over here? There was one more thing I could do to it, right? Greece and expand borders. No, I don't want a borders, but we'll do Greece. The Fisher Wharf. Uh, Building completed. We need that as well. Lures. Okay, we'll do that. Building is done. We're going to get some new people in. Those people are immediately going to go to work from uh, building the walls. Where is she at? Where did she go? Is she over here? Kind of sounds like she's over here. Maybe she's over here. 
and I can't see her. So let's stay up. She's building this wall. So this wall was never really quite done. Apparently, it can get even bigger than it is right now. Hmm. Okay, I'll let her continue doing that. Actually, let's look at that. Let's look at her build. I want to see if she has a little hammer in her hand or not. Um, no, I don't see a hammer. I bet you more than anything she's going to get a hammer later on in future expansions. But right now, there's yeah, there's no hammer there in her hand. Let's uh, change the, the camera angle back to where I am familiar with it so I know where everything is. Let's see, how are you guys doing over here? Anything to loot yet? No, nothing to loot just yet. Over here, yep, the spider died. We'll take that. Again, there is going to be a crafting system in the game at some point. It's just not here just yet. Let's come in here. I want to see how close we are to getting somebody. Yeah, the happiness rating isn't as high as it could be. Let's do um, a little bit more into food. Food variety goes up with a negative, even though it's still going up positive with the food. So, yeah, we're going to do that. We have plenty of it. 1,000? Yeah. 1,000 for 15 people? That's not even like that's not even a right away. It's not gonna happen. Wait, who did I click on? I didn't mean to click that. Be right there, darling. Let's click that off. I don't know what she's doing, but she'll go back to her work in a minute. Okay, how close do we get another person? Almost here. Here we go. One more person coming in. Settlers have arrived. Two more people coming in, actually. Stop. Three. No, we got three people there. Okay. Nice. Now, where are you going? Where on earth are you? Oh, is he going all the way around to the outside? I think he is. He's going to travel this whole way. We got some loot over here, so this is not the first time these guys have made this run. Holy crap, man. They go a long, long attack. way out here. Where am I getting attacked from? Oh, crap. Okay. Sir Gregory, where are you at? Come on. Command. Get over here. This is why I needed to uh, build that wall. And I didn't get to it in time. Ah, oh, crap. She died. She's probably like level 3 or 4 or something like that. And that was, you know, a pretty good rating. Where is Sir Gregor? What are you doing? Hello. Get your butt over here, man. I told you to attack. Come to daddy. Here we go. Do taunt. Do a bash. What are you waiting for? There you New go. And uh, wait for it. I guess we're going to do Iron Skin just because... We'll also do a power slam, and then we'll wait for her to be down to 30%, and we're going to use decisive victory. And the reason he has so much power is because we have upgraded his his uh, mind so many times. Here we go. Kill it. Dead. Nice. Nothing really fantastic on that. You call. And until we uh, get that wall built, I'm going to have him come over here and stand here so that does not happen again because I did not like the fact that that guy died on me. Oh, man. That sucks. Okay. Actually, let's build another wall. I kind of want to get into the building the next buildings phase, but I need to protect this. Let's do this right there. We're going to do trebuchet right there and trebuchet on this one as well because it's so far away. I don't think it's going to be able to hit anything otherwise. And can we put a... No, we still can't do that one. I think maybe because it's not done. If it was fully built, we might be able to do it, but until it is, we're going to have to wait. Wow, these things take forever to be built. Okay, let's do one more cottage. I, I don't want to go too much on the the housing because I know it's going to get me to that, that limit, and I'm going to need the food and the, the, the yeah, all that other stuff, and we just don't have it yet. Right there. Okay. But I need the people. I need them to finish these walls. I should take my time, but uh, getting a little bit into a rush here so we can get that going. Uh, what are you guys... Oh, because it's still attacking over here. That's where that noise is. Although you shouldn't really hear it on the other side of the map when you're nowhere close to it. So, is it firing on somebody over here too? Maybe it's because multiple ones are firing. Where is it firing? Let's see if we can figure it out. Oh, right there. Oh, nice. And it did kill some of them already. Okay, we'll take that. We'll take that as well. And uh, she's going to be dead here in a minute as well. So, that's good. I think that's... Standing ready. I think that's safe. We don't really need him ready. here anymore. Let's bring him back over to the other opening. The only place that we're actually vulnerable I at the moment. Leave. Okay, I think you guys are all set. Well, it's not killing these things. I mean, it's, it's damaging them, but it's not quite killing them. So I may have to send my guys in there to, to finish it up. Wow, look at that. 
You can see it slowly going up over time. Okay, where are all my guys? Did they build this? Nope, they're all bu too busy doing something else at the moment. Let's see, this is fully maxed out. Sawmill research. Nope, that's right, we weren't uh, maxing that one out. We are maxing all the other ones out. Mm. I guess we can expand the borders. I mean, this one might be worth it because there's a lot of farms and stuff we can build for it. So let's do that one. How about this one? Expand borders. No, we don't even have enough gold for it at the moment. Let's go into civics. How are we doing? Plus three. Are we getting more people? No, we're fully maxed out. How much how much firewood do we have? It like rearranges my inventory whenever it feels like it. A thousand firewood. That's actually pretty good. Actually, 1100. So let's, let's expand that up a little bit. Let's give them a little bit more firewood so they're a little happier. And I'll be able to raise my taxes up a little bit higher again and get a little bit more gold uh, faster. Let's see. Where do we have a worker? I want them to build that house. So let's grab you and tell you to come over here and do that house real quick, that cottage. And I think I have enough cottages for the rest of the game, to be honest, guys. Once I upgrade these cottages to the next tier, we're going to get another four out of that. And I think they can go up to tier three as well. So, yeah, another... Uh, Another eight per house, and that's going to be more than enough citizens to kind of do what I need to do. Of course, it is more expensive to upgrade than it is to build a new house, but in the end, space is very valuable in this game, and I'd rather use it for farms and different different buildings that we really want to have access to. As you can see, we really don't have a huge area to build in because it kind of cordoned ourselves off. But if you don't do this, you're just going to get wrecked. Yeah, I, you know, I can't tell you how many times that I came in here. I actually played two separate games uh, each one about two and a half to three hours I recorded all of it I don't know if I'll upload it I might at some date upload it and just uh, put it in like a separate playlist of like failed attempts at this game of me coming through and just checking it out because uh, it the was has been constructed it was my first like blind play I didn't know anything I didn't go through the tutorial I didn't do any of that stuff so yeah it was just me coming through just trying to figure it out as we go along and now I've actually gone back and I've had a little bit of experience playing it and not just that, but I actually watched the video where the uh, the producer themselves, the the guy, I forgot what his name is. I wish I could remember your name, and I apologize for that. He was very, very helpful with the information that he had on how to build stuff and some of the new updates they do. They do a little Let's Play. Of course, he's doing a lot of work, and he's, you know, new doing the, have the coding, and he's, you know, in charge of an entire company and, and you know there's just a lot of stuff for them i don't know where this this woman is going but she's going the long way around but yeah they have a lot of stuff on their plate so they don't do the videos as often as they would like the enemy is in our village where oh up here at the top okay what would you have me do let's see we want you to attack Settlers have arrived. this one i'm gonna go ahead and get stuff. taunt get shield bash and uh iron skin We'll also wait for you to uh, let's get rid of that because I don't want you to guys all see. in there. Little worker, yeah. Okay, so they're good. Get down to about twenty percent. Use it. I uh, used it a little bit too soon. Almost killed them though, and that's fine. It's it's gonna kill them now. Let's see. Get rid of the spider den. That thing pops up really really quickly if you let it, guys. Really quickly. So that's why I like to have these towers nearby. Got a little bit of gold coin out of that as well, so that's not too bad. Uh, let's bring okay. these guys back a little bit. Where are those dudes going? Like, they're going around the long, long way. Let's see what is over here. Mm. Well, I can hear the noise even more over here where there's nothing going on than I can next to my base where the actual trebuchet is. So, I'm guessing that's a bug. I'm guessing that's not supposed to be that loud. Can I build that? Still can't build that because it's not done yet. This wall looks done, though. And I can upgrade it to a gatehouse, so let's do that. So that's upgraded to a gatehouse. I'm going to close off this wall real quick so it's completely done. Nice. Okay, let's click that off. Let's do... Let's do the archery, the crossbows. No? I guess they don't want to do the crossbows. Let's do a trebuchet then. It's just uh, not really the perfect angle for it, but I guess we're going to do it. Okay, how you guys doing over here? Pretty good on everything. Let's see, where are my workers? 
Oh yeah, see they're all building this one out here on the outside. I got one, two, three, four of them doing it. And the only way to get inside my base is to go back the long way. Because they haven't built a wall here on the center where I could put another one of those gates and let them come out the easy way. Might, uh, might just tell them to do that while they're out here. Hopefully they won't run back inside to get food and things of that sort because they do need to get that every so often whether they're they're doing anything else or not. What is firing? What is that noise? This thing has been firing the whole game. I hope that noise doesn't continue. I get it already, dude. You're firing. Uh, can I load it with something? What does that do? That doesn't do anything, does it? Okay. Leave that there. Now you are only allowed so many resources with the supply wagon. If you want to increase that, you have to build one of those storehouses. Let's see, do we have what it takes to build a storehouse? One, 140, 50, yeah, we could do that. We could build a storehouse right over here. If I can fit it in there, uh, they're right there. Nice, we'll fit that in there right there. And that is going to raise up my culture rating just slightly, but it's gonna allow them to deliver the stone these guys won't have to walk as far, and they'll be able to pick up food as well. The same thing goes for the fishing hut. They'll be able to access that a little quicker. Now, I need to build a... Where is it? A bakery. Bakery... Uh, not that. Come on, where's the bakery? Oh, I think it's in the other one. That's right. It's over here. So we're going to bake some bread. That's, uh, I don't think this needs to be close by to this. It just needs to be close by to one of the, the storehouses. So let's build that over here. And we'll get that as close as possible. Right there. Nice. And that still leaves us room for maybe a couple houses down here in the future. If that's the route we want to go. So both of those are going to be there. And that's, that's going to be good. Okay, let's see. How are you guys doing? Still building this thing. Wow, these walls take a while. Even with four people down here. Two of them on one wall, two of them on the other. And this noise, this noise is starting to irritate me. Stop it already. We get it. We get, oh crap, okay. If you won't stop, then I'll send my guys down here to help finish off whatever it is you're attacking. So we can get this noise to go away. Hopefully, with any luck. Here we go, come on, get him down to 20%. Use your attack. Nice. What do you got? Nope, nothing good on you, not this time. Let's bring you over here. We're going to attack all three of these guys. And, and we'll bring them back. All right, dear. We'll bring one of them back anyways. There we go. One Forward. at a time. Do a uh, stun. Do a shield bash on you. And then we'll do decisive victory. Oh, yeah. Only four gold coin on you. Okay, let's take you on. You know what's been going on is we've been attacking these guys for so long that they're just completely you know, um, desensitized to the fact that they're getting attacked by somebody who's actually here and in their face. So you are stunned. I could use decisive victory on you, but at the moment it's not really worth it. Let's do... And eh, we don't use any taunt. Let's do decisive victory. There we go. What do we got? What do we got? New pants? Mm, you know, they're alright for regular person, so we can put those on somebody. And that noise is still going on, even though nobody is over here. And he did get a level, so let's go ahead and level him up to, uh, don't really need mind anymore. Let's go with health, vitality. We'll give him a little bit more health, just in case. Oh, geez, could you stop with the noise? Who is, who is still attacking? Not you, not you, not you. You're still attacking. What are you attacking? What are you attacking? Way over here? There's no way you're hitting that way over there. Let's see, what is he firing at? Actually, he's not attacking anymore. You? Yes, you're still attacking. And I think you're attacking this thing. So let's bring our guys over here. We'll take these uh, these spiders out. Can I build a doorway? I still can't build that because it's being constructed. Where? Where are they ransacking our village? I don't see it. There's nobody inside my village. You guys are a bunch of... A bunch of liars. <laughs> I don't see it. I don't see any marauders. Just those spiders that we saw earlier. Yeah, we're good. Oh, man, that noise. That noise is going to drive me nuts. Okay, so that's still working on over there. Are they building any of the buildings over here? Not just yet, because they're too busy doing all that other stuff that I told them to do. 
How about over here? Nope, not that either. Wow, these walls. These walls. Ah, oh, jeez, guys, that noise is so annoying. I think what we're going to go ahead and do is, in the episode here, I'm going to exit out of the game, come back into it between this episode and the next one. Hopefully that noise will have stopped. It is one of those things that just kind of pops up and does not want to go away for a while. And uh, I will let my walls get built a little bit before we start the next episode because that's kind of one of the things we're just waiting on. We just have to sit here and wait for that before any of the buildings on the inside get done. Now, I could always put more houses down, but I don't like to do that because it's going to raise our... Uh, our culture rating up and we're very very close to needing that flower as well as needing the the clothing we're going to need that fairly soon here as well so again guys i want to thank you all for watching if you do enjoy this video be sure to hit that like button subscribe definitely helps grow the channel and i greatly appreciate it but more than that go ahead and go on to steam guys if you like this and uh, give them a good rating let the other people know write a little review even if it's a, something as simple as hey this game looks really cool I've, I've seen a lot of let's plays of it I like what they're doing with it they are doing uh, weekly patches now guys so the videos have slowed down for them they're not doing as many because they are doing so many patches I still think it's a fantastic game and uh, you know I can't wait to see what they're gonna do with it here in the future it is selling for $24.99 normally but the price right now is $18.74 definitely worth the price i think uh, definitely check it out as well and until next time guys